main purposes of a music video is that it's to promote the artist to sell the song. This also allows it to reach out to fans and to create a visual representation of the artist. For example, in the music video The World's Greatest, it's a well popular song as sung by a well known artist, R. Kelly. This means music becomes a visual me medium to the public and audience. Also, selling the song and getting loads of downloads helps increase revenue for the record label to get a better and be more successful. Other purposes of music videos are if the people like the music video and the artist, they start to listen to the song more and give it more hits, which makes the rec record label and the artist more money. This gives the music video opportunities for synergy, which is two things you put together to work better together, such as editing the music video, such as the lyrics in time with a beat and the music. There are many purposes for music videos, however, there are main, these are the main points and interesting points needed to know. Music videos create many opportunities for the artist and record label as it gives them more media and attention. To discuss his close-ups that focus on the artist. In the music video, Crepton Cone and My Story, it shows lots of close-ups of the artist as it's about the story of his life. It focuses on the main artist because it wants to show the target audience that they are the main artist. Also, it shows a first-person point of view from telling us their story. What happens throughout their life? However, in the music video, Duke Dumont, I've Got You, it has close-ups of the person in the video. This isn't the main artist. Although it don't show the artist, it has close-ups of the person playing the main artist throughout the video. The other difference between these two music videos is that they are different genres of music. One is pop and the other one is rap. The second convention I'm going to discuss is editing. It's cut to the beat. In the first music video, Crepton Cone and My Story, this is being used really well as each action in the video is cut to the beat of the song perfectly. This shows to the target audience that it is a well organised song and has, put to, has been put together really well. However, in the second music video, Duke Dumont I Got You, it shows what the song is about and what it's meaning, so in the sense of it is mostly cut to the beat of the music. Both of these music videos are well organised and cut to the beat. This shows the effect of cutting to the beat is that it's in time with the music and looks really professional. Another convention I'm going to discuss is performance. In Crepton Conan music video there is a lot of singing and acting but there is no instruments or dancing included. However in the music video it is based on a true story. The actions in the music video are in time with the song and the singing was in time with the actions. Although in Duke Dumont I've got you there is dancing included. This shows that the music video is that they're having a good time and enjoying themselves. Another convention for these two music videos is montage editing and cross cutting between different locations. In Duke Mon music video, there is a lot of cross cutting between different locations, as one minute he is sitting in a chair and the next he is in paradise. Also, whilst he is in paradise, he is often changing to different parts of the house and beach. However, in Crepton Cone music video, there are there is a lot of cross cutting between different locations in the street and the house, so they get a better view of the music video and the artists singing and rapping. In this paragraph, I've chose two different music videos. One is Sam Smith, I'm Not the Only One, and the other is Bastille Pompeii. The convention I'm going to discuss with these two music videos is a narrative. In the video, Sam Smith. I'm not the only one in the narrative is that the man in the video is cheating on his wife and this shows that he isn't trustworthy. In Bastille Pompeii there is also narratives as he is the only one with until the end of the music video with black eyes. So there is connected news from the video and different people. In this paragraph, I'm going to discuss the convention lip syncing. The two videos I'm going to discuss in this convention are Katy Perry War, as in the music video, sometimes she isn't singing when the song is playing, as if she was. In this convention, I'm going to discuss Katy Perry War. The convention I'm going to discuss 
is the appearance of the artist. As you see in Katy Perry's music video, she appears throughout the video in different types of shots and angles. In the video, she isn't playing any instruments, which suggests she is.